you were seen walking into your dorm with alcohol. Okay. Is there alcohol in there? Uh, I don't answer questions. What's your name and your badge number? Officer Pirtle, NMSU Police. Title and name? Uh, the security officer. Oh, security officer, okay. Okay. You have an ID with you? Uh, I do. Okay, can I see it? Uh, you suspect me of a crime? I do. Okay, what crime and how can you articulate it? Minor in possession of alcohol. We got a report that you were walked in. So it's like here that they say, they said thing? Okay. It's a, yeah, right? It's like they said that he has. And that that's how you're gonna articulate it. So we don't have to go down this route. If you wanna, if you wanna go down this route, we can. Well, I really don't, but like you're, I'm studying right now. I'm doing okay. homework. You can knock on my door. I'm out here. I wanna know what's on. You say that they, they said? That there's alcohol in this room. Okay. Oh, they, they saw me uh -huh. going into this room, and that there's alcohol in there. How can you articulate it, though? Okay, so that's why I'm here talking to you. Yeah. Okay. So I still need to ID you. Uh, no. And then we need to go from there. You have to. You have to suspect me of a crime. I, I do. You you're, you realize that uh, cops in New Mexico don't have qualified immunity, right? I do that. I do. Okay, that. so from from here on. Just let's just be careful with the, what you are about to do right now. Okay. You're saying that you want my ID, but right now you're not. You or yourself can articulate a crime that I've committed. Okay. So. So I already explained to you why I'm here. Why okay. I, need your I know. ID. I know what you're here, but okay. Is my ID gonna tell you if there's alcohol in that room? No. But I still need to identify you. My name is Joel. Joel what? Joel. I need your first last name and your date of birth. No, you don't. I do. If you don't want to provide that, you don't want to call Officer Donovan or one of your supervisors here. Yeah, I can get a sergeant. Over uh, then I'm calling him because right now, this is not what you want to do right now, because okay. this is a violation of my Fourth Amendment. Okay. All right. Let me okay. let me get a sergeant over here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Name and badge number, please. Sergeant John Lovelace. My badge number is two one two. Two one two. All right. Thank you. Uh, officer said here that if I don't ID, I will be subject to arrest. Is that true? It's possible. Yes. Uh, possible. Yes or no? I need I need that ultimatum, or else I won't get my ID. Okay, so technically right now, yes, you could be arrested. Could. I need a yes or no. Like, I need you to tell me if you don't give me your ID right now, I'm going to arrest you. Why, why would I say that to you? Because I need that ultimatum. Because right now you're asking. Yes. And I have the right to say no. Because you're asking. You're not. It's not a lawful order. Okay. I need you to so make it a lawful order. you're being order. detained for suspicion of minor um, in possession of alcohol, mm -hmm. you need to see your ID. Okay, and if not? And if not, you could be considered could? to identity. Because... New Mexico statute says that concealing of identity is a secondary charge. I would have to have been arrested or suspected of a crime. No, right now, you hear you just don't hearsay. Have to be arrested or suspected? You're being suspected of a crime. On, on what? On what grounds? Okay. So, do you have any alcohol in your possession? I don't answer questions. On what grounds? Okay. So, you don't have any alcohol in your oh, possession. God. On what grounds? I don't answer questions. No, I won't grab. Okay. Yeah, that's what I mean, bro. Okay. So, the easiest and simplest solution to this is for you to tell us your name, date of birth. Joel. Joel White. Joel. Okay, by just saying Joel, there's a thousand Joels. I need a last name mm -hmm. and date of birth. For what? You're going to run? I told you, you want my name. For the report, I need to have your name and date you of birth. Can, I didn't even have to give you my first name for that report. You could literally put the citizen or the or the guy or the suspect. Yes, you it can. Work like that. Yes, it does. I'm a law student here. You're not going to come over here and try to violate my rights. So I'm not trying to violate your rights, and I'm trying to be cooperative with you, and you be cooperative okay, I'm with us. Cooperate with me in the sense that I'm not going to give my ID unless I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get arrested. Say it and I'll give you my ID. Just say, if you don't give me your ID, I'm going to arrest you. So you want us to threaten you? you. Want us to threaten yes, you. I want you to give me that ultimatum if you really want the ID. You. That's not how this is Why? Right. Because you know you can't. You know you don't have that ultimatum. You know you can because you know that opens up for litigation. And to make this clear, I'm detained right now, right? Correct. Thank you. Have to stay over. Uh, no, I can't. You, you, I'm in no, your view. I'm telling you, you need to stay over here. <laughs> Just keep recording, Sean. Don't let him intimidate you. <laughs>